My name is Lori Quiring and I'm from Washington State University. Victoria Insidovich with the University of California, Irvine. My name is Dana Broly and I'm the Director of International Recruitment at Seattle University. Today we did the India Conclave. Um, and it was absolutely amazing. Great conversation all day long, working on building relationships, not just sitting at a table, handing out brochures and having quick conversations with students. It's actually building relationships, creating ideas and opportunities for collaboration that we can build on going forward. Today what I think was really the biggest takeaway was just a desire for the K through 12 schools in India wanting to collaborate with universities in ways around teaching and partnership, um, ways to enhance education, to, to introduce their students to what it means to go to a university in the U.S. and then for us, for universities, to just gain an even deeper insight into the education system at a younger level. And, and what it means to start talking practicalities of perhaps a, a global education at a higher grade level. But the idea to partner on programs, to actually do some things beyond simply talking, what does it take to be admitted? Yesterday, uh, visiting the different schools was absolutely amazing. I loved seeing the interactions between the students and the faculty and the guests from India. Um, it was very impressive to see how the students are connecting, um, especially at SAMI, inside and outside of the classroom. Um, I think it's a great opportunity for bringing guests from overseas to see the education system in the U.S. and for us as university reps to make connections and learn at the same time together. Well, it's been a wonderful week of experiences with a group from India, of educators who came to our campus to learn about U.S. education system and to share their experiences in their passion for educating young people. So it's been a great experience. We had a lot of amazing conversations about culture, about best practices in educating, how to engage students, how to help them reach their potential, some of the challenges that we face in this world of technology, um, and how we can best support their success in a growing and changing world. It was a really, really a dynamic experience. My name's Katie and I work at Tacoma Community College in Tacoma, Washington. The India Conclave today was all about learning about the education systems in India and how they compare to the U.S. and ways in which our two education systems can collaborate, work together, and how we can all serve students better. My name is Sean Greenfield. I'm with the University of Idaho over in Moscow, Idaho. The Conclave was a wonderful opportunity to connect with administrators from all across India and other peer institutions as well. So it was a wonderful networking opportunity to ask questions and to really get a better insight into the Indian kind of administrator's mind, but also some of the students. So I felt that hearing insights directly from the students that visited was extremely helpful just to kind of hear their path from beginning to near towards the end of their journey. Um, and honestly, just a lot of the open forums, the questions, um, even just the tabling opportunities where we had to have that one-on-one -on -one interaction was really helpful. Just to kind of hear the needs of the administrators and kind of what they're looking for in terms of partnerships. from Cornell College and uh, um, I learned so much today. It's a great opportunity for me to meet with a lot of wonderful um, educators from India and um, um, it was a great event and I learned a lot. I'm from Whitworth University.
University in Spokane, Washington. And for me today has been a really inspiring day. It, being together with this group of Indian educators has reminded me of why I'm passionate about international education. Um, you know, I, those of us from American institutions who are here, we're from very different cultures and the discussions about our cultural differences I think help, have helped us to bridge those differences. With all the great discussions that were going on by the end of this day, I feel like those cultural differences are really fascinating and wonderful, but at the end, we are all humans and we are all passionate about helping students and to make the world better. And this has been a great um, program for doing this.